Hey, you YouTubers, Tazman here, and I'm bringing you a new series by your guys' request. So I've had quite a few of you guys say, Hey, Taz, can you play Agrarian Skies? And I have played it uh, quite a bit. Um, and all I've done here is, this is a brand new world, and all I did was go rename the folder and rename the world. That way I can keep track of it better because I actually have one that I'm playing on uh, that uh, is pretty far, but I don't want to be very far. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and jump in this world. Brand spanking new. And we're going to play. So here's my goal for this. For any of you guys who don't know how uh, to load this up, let's check. I like to have that on. Uh, if press F7, you can see spots where it's dark enough for mobs to potentially spawn by little uh, yellow X's. Uh, hold on just one second. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, so my goal in this is to... Um, hold on. Alright, so my goal in... If I could talk, actually, you know what I should do? Plant the tree real quick before I start talking. Um, so my goal in this is to not complete any quests unless it's on camera. Uh, to build, grindy build stuff, maybe I'll do, but other builds I'll probably do on camera also. Um, but grinding I will definitely do off camera because you don't want to sit see me uh you know just uh at a cobblestone generator for a full episode so i'll do stuff like that off camera but uh, other stuff i'll do on so first thing i'm going to do is get rid of some of this stinking redstone brick post stuff and like i said i have played a little bit of this i haven't really i I pretty much only got to the quest uh, where I build a smell tree, so it's not way too far into it. So, uh, and I'll be probably looking a lot at you guys for your assistance on how to do stuff because I know some of the stuff here and I'm learning it as I go, but I am not pro. Let's get rid of this stuff. Micro blocks. Alright, so the first thing we need to do is check our quest book. It has been a horrible 10 years. Code Wizards and I'm not going to listen to this. Basically, it says that uh, bad stuff's happened and I was, I was granted sanctuary or something like that and given this small island, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so we start out with two lives. There are 110 quests that we can complete. And like I said, um, I've only done that one, that one, that one, uh, those three, that one, 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 and that one. So really there's still a bunch still there, and then we have all these other ones too. So I think we're going to have a lot of fun, and it's already nighttime. And look at all them spots mobs can spawn. Oh, and I didn't do a thing other than talk. <laughs> I'm brilliant. Alright, so we're going to hurry really quick. Hopefully nothing spawns. Come on. Oh, come on. You're wasting all my stuff. Okay, we're going to go in here. We're going to grab a couple of these guys. It's so scary starting this guy out. Alright, so first thing we want to do is build this crafting table and then upgrade it to a crafting station. And we're going to throw it right about there. And make us some sticks. So we can start. But let's go ahead and read our, uh, our book. Oh, and it's already raining. 
Uh, we're gonna have to hurry and do this. <laughs> we're gonna have to do this part really quick first. Hopefully we get a sapling. Now I believe as long as you're in this middle area, uh, nothing can spawn because you're uh, you're within 23 blocks of either end of the island. If I move over there or go up over that way, uh, then we can start seeing mobs spawn because we're past that 23 blocks. So good to keep in mind. We've got to get some barrels going, so that's that's going to be our top priority. Where are you at? There we go. Top priority is going to be quickly get some barrels so we can collect rainwater. And I do not know if we're going to have enough to even make a barrel. No. <laughs> Great start, guys. All right, let's hit this guy. Oh no, not hit that guy. I lied. Come on. I probably should... Oh my gosh. It's wasting all my... My bone mill. Quit it. There we go. Oh. No mobs. No mobs yet. So, um... If you're starting this, and if you're playing along with me, that'd be great. But, uh... First thing we want to do is quickly get some barrels going to catch rainwater. Man, that is not really I guess what I should have done is actually just made the barrels <laughs> instead of broke all the leaves. goal here is at least three barrels. Our next thing will be to make steps so that uh, we don't have to jump so much. Uh, so let's do you. Boom. Boom. There we go. And throw you there. And doo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, three. That's good enough. Alright, and we're going to throw these three barrels so they can start collecting rainwater for us. Right there, there, and there. And there we go. Okay. So now we're doing pretty good. Um, let's just keep working on our trees tonight. Oh, don't use so much of my bone mill, please. There we go. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like sometimes if you get a different angle um, on the sapling, there's a higher chance. Like if you're standing in one spot, it's not growing. Uh, move a little one direction or the other and it might grow. Like I said, <laughs> I could be up in the night on that. Alright, so now that we got our barrels going, uh, we're going to kind of... Uh, actually, yeah, we, we're going to break this tree so we have some wooden stuff because we're going to need that. And then we're going to go do our first three quests. We're going to get on a quest done just today, so... This is great. I can't believe we didn't get any worms yet. Okay, so those guys filling up nicely. Let's go in the house, and we're going to try and stay kind of here in this corner, because I think if we go too far that way, mobs will start spawning. We do not want that. So let's go ahead and check our quest book. Uh, first thing we have here is using it. Uh, this will get us a pickaxe. We just need to, and we've already done it, we just need to craft some wooden planks. Look how epic we are. We just got an apple. Alright, let's put that up there. That there. Just getting a little bit organized real quick. Um, let's get some sticks. We don't want those. All right, next quest. Uh, by the way, to go into a quest, you actually click the left click. To get out, you just hit the right button. So let's do this guy. Now we need to select a task. And manual submit. And claim our reward. Now we're going to 
put this guy up here. Some quests you actually have to enter in items. There we go. So let's see our next quest. See, told you we are cruising. <laughs> Alright, so this one we need to use the hopper system here and we need to submit. So first thing we have to do is do select task, hit escape, right click on that so that it's linked up to my book. And take one of these planks, put it in the hopper, and open the book. We're 100% there. Now we have a sub-quest, so as you can see now there's this guy. No hope given. We have to turn back in our hopper. So we need our pickaxe. Oh, wrong button. First time I did this, I... I couldn't remember if uh, if using your hand would break it. Uh, hold on, just one second. Uh, let's see. Okay, so now go back to the book. No quest given. Manual submit. Claim reward. All right, we got our first reward. Ho 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 these guys over I keep my hearts here I'm not gonna eat all the hearts right away I'm gonna kind of save them up as we go all right and we got a basic reward bag be something good 64 glowstone actually that's not too bad we can light up our island with those not too shabby so we can actually take these little guys can I put it down you put it there. So now you're seeing these X's are disappearing. That is good. <laughs> Let me right there. Right there. Pretty good. I don't want to. Oh, the sun's coming up too, so that's really good. There. We got any down. it up. Um, where do I want to stick you? Right there. Make sure I don't have any more. Boom. Now I don't know if this guarantees no mobs will spawn. If if you have no uh, none of the uh, none of the yellow X's showing, I don't know if it's a guarantee that we will not see any mobs. But uh, I believe it helps. <laughs> so, all right. And then the next thing I like to do is take out this guy and his buddy. Oh, we did get a worm. Too. I like to cap off the water down here because sometimes if you get a big tree it might fall in the water uh, so I just put one like that one like that and now everything will go there all right so hey we're doing pretty good uh, let's see we need oh what am I doing <laughs> guys in there. Alright, let's check our quest and I'll explain why I broke that in just a minute. Uh, in just a second. Um, let's break some of this stuff out real quick. Oh. I thought I got something. Okay, so top priorities right now are we, we've got our island lit up pretty good, so we're happy with that. Uh, but food is definitely a big one. We need food bad. So uh, food 
is going to be hopefully number one. And I think our next quest actually, I think it's the barrels and stuff. One second, I'll be right back. See you in a minute, guys. And we're back. All right. So, um, I, for life, me can't remember what we were talking about. Um, one thing I was gonna do, and I'm gonna go into cheat mode for this. Uh, probably at least once an episode, we're gonna fly out just a distance from here, and we're gonna use a screenshot. Uh, and we're gonna use that for our. Uh, our thumbnail for our video so we'll probably just fly out there won't give ourselves anything or anything special like that we're just gonna fly out there a little way so we can see the island I think it'd be kinda cool to keep an eye on the progress we make uh, alright so let's go ahead and look at what our next tasks are so we did that, did that, that, now we're on this one oh hit the wrong button, left click so now we need to make a chest, a part builder, a tool station, a stencil table. We already made our bucket, or our barrel, and we already made a crook. Um, we're down three. We got water, so we're good. Oh, why didn't I plant that? Oh, I'm a dummy. We could have had a tree that would have grown naturally. I'm gonna break this crook, too. Now I don't want to break any leaves uh, without a crook and the reason for that is there's a higher chance of you getting saplings with a crook plus you get the bonus of getting a silkworm every now and then <coughs> and uh, on a sky block you definitely want to get as many saplings as you can oh, did we just get a worm? no, no worm Well, once we get all that other stuff, we need to make us an axe. Okay, so we're going to use what we get here. And let's see, what was our quest? We're going to need how many stencils? Uh, four. Okay, so we're going to need four of these guys. Okay, so we got those. So we need one of these. Our part builder. We need one of these. Our stencil table. Oh, we're going to need another tree at least. And we need... Oh. And these are tool station. And we need a chest. Poop. What did the bone know? I just put the wrong thing up. Oh, and I didn't plant another tree. Oh, we're doing so good. Come on, grow. There we go. Now, for those of you guys that are not familiar with the Green Skies, it has some mean mods in it that actually I find make it really fun. One of them is something to do with hunger. I don't know if it's called like hunger overhaul or something like that. But basically, almost everything you eat does half a meat pop uh, healing. So where an apple normally does one in Minecraft, in this, it does half. Where does an apple do two? I think apple does two. But yeah, watch this. We're going to eat an apple. We got two apples. 
half a meat pot half a meat pot which is why we want to put stairs all over the place once we get this stuff going uh, because let's see so we got that 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 and then we need some chests so so we're gonna make the chest I'm gonna turn this into a pattern chest and we want that's why I dug that out right there so we're gonna go ahead and take our stencil table our I think part builder yes and followed by our so we should be able, or our tool builder, tool station. <laughs> All right, so let's turn in this quest, and thank goodness we're getting more apples. Um, axe of despair or pan of destiny. We're gonna make an axe, and food is definitely a big one, and we want to be able to cook it, because a lot of times that makes it better. So we're gonna choose the pan of destiny. And there we go. We keep our heart, quarter heart. We're gonna keep our apples here, and we're gonna plop down our pan right there. Oh, beautiful. And let's throw these guys in there for now. So we have one worm. Yeah, we're going to need a real chest, too. Maybe we should hurry and make that. Put that down right there. We can get rid of some of this stuff. Let's put that in there. Those and those. Alright, let's see what's in our oh, basic bag. Although, it really does seem like basic, good, and whatever else isn't quite so important. Blackstone bricks. Not too bad, I guess. Building bricks. Not very many of them. Oh, oh, oh not you. Or you. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> did I plant another tree? Oh, I did. I finally did. <laughs> Alright, so let's check our next... Actually, let's eat real quick. This will take eight stinking apples. Okay, so let's check our next quest. So did that one. So now we have the string one. And our tree's not grown. Let's go grow it up real quick. Come on, grow. Oh my gosh. Grow. And now we're stuck. Uh, crap. I don't want to break any leaves. Dang it. <laughs> Alright, let's put our worm in here. And wait forever. Okay, so let's see if there's anything else we can do while we wait. We finish that. Nope, we can't. Poop. Now we can wait. Maybe what I'll do is I'm going to go ahead. I'm not going to play. I'm not going to do anything. But I'm going to pause the video here. We're going to let the tree turn white, and then we'll resume from there. Oh, I can get on there. There we go. So I'm going to stand in this corner because most, it seems from the map up there that it's closest to the middle of the island. So hopefully no mobs will spawn. And I will see you in a minute or so. We'll be second for you, but it'll be a bit longer for me because I have to wait for the tree to turn white. So I'll see you in a minute, guys. We're back. Sorry, it actually took a lot longer than I thought. Um, <laughs> I stepped away from my computer, but the tree is all white, so that's good. Uh, do we need a new crook? Nope, we're good. Right, let's see if we can get him some string. Hopefully a lot. And some more worms. That'd be great. Oh, just got two worms. I'm gonna wait for those leaves. Oh, those leaves. Actually, that one's gonna despawn now. Might as well. Oh, we still got it. I guess you don't. Huh, maybe you don't have to wait. Maybe that no room. Let's still 
dropping stuff. Alright, now hopefully we have enough string for everything we need. And we're getting hungry, so we need to hurry and get a move on. <laughs> Let's see, so we need three wool, nine, nine, that's 18, 12, that's 30, no, we're not going to have enough. Alright, well let's do this, while we start doing, right, I don't want to do it from there, let's try here. Nope, nope, come on, grow. Alright, let's put another worm on the tree, and we'll go do what we can. Um, these other ones in here. Uh, yeah, what am I doing? Oh my gosh. Alright, so let's see. What do we got to do for the string quest? Uh, do -ba -do -ba -do. Click here, click here. Uh, we need to make a sieve. We need to make a fishing pole. We can make the hammer, the bed. I'm not sure. So let's just see what we can do. Two seeds that leaves us. Yeah. Alright, the other thing that is critical at this juncture is we need to go fish real quick. So let me show you. I found a pretty good spot. Oh, we need our. Don't want to do all this jumping. If you stand right here and put it so this block right here is just where your thing is, so that you're right on the corner there just a little shy and then you aim right about there yes you're able to do some pretty good fishing so let's i'm gonna do that and i'll be back after i catch some fish so i'll see you guys in another yet yeah, another minute okay we're back and i'm just doing some final fishing i think we might have one down at the very bottom that popped up maybe he despawned by now uh, we've got 21. Uh, I forgot one critical thing. Uh, yeah, we're good. I forgot up on top of the roof there uh, is still dark and we're 23 blocks away. So uh, we actually had a skeleton spawn up there and a couple spiders. They came down after us. Oh, and it's raining again. Oh yeah, we still got our fish is down here. All right, so we got 22 fish, very good. We are going to go ahead and stick them. Now, for those of you who don't know how to use the frying pan, you have to leave at least, uh, like if I have one stack of stuff, I need to leave one, one block open for it all to go into when it's done. If I had two stacks of stuff, I need to leave two stacks. So we're just gonna oh, mess, mess up there. Looks like we got... Or, and I don't know if this is superstition or what, but it seems like these last longer <laughs> if I do half slabs. So we're going to have plenty of food in just a few minutes. It looks like our tree is done. So let's get more string. Put that there. We'll be able to make our bed. Complete this quest. And... Move on. Not our seed, our uh, crook. I'm not a crook. Wow, one worm. That's terrible. Let's see if anything fell. Like I said, sometimes things will fall over and they'll land in the water. There's been a couple times I found leaves or or something in there. All right, so this will give us more. What we need to do now is probably make us a an 
axe. Of course, we need to finish this darn quest. Oh, the other thing before you guys yell at me. I do know that there's a dirt chest down here with seven dirt. I almost forgot. No, I almost forgot to plant my tree. Okay, so let's put our seven dirt there. Put our worms there. Looks good, good, good. Alright. Hopefully some of our fish are done. Oh, 14 are done. Beautiful. Now the nice thing about cooked fish in this mod pack, they heal you for one each. So it's a full meat pop. Now, uh, one really good thing is if we get to a point where we get bread, uh, we can actually, or er, yeah, if we can make bread, if we cook the bread to toast, that heals us for two meat pops. Alright, so let's go and, oh, I might want one of these fish. Give me that fish. <laughs> okay. Because that's going to be a quest item, I believe. I think. Yeah. Alright, so now we need a bed and our sieve. Oh, we could have actually made our sieve, couldn't have we? Silly me. Is it? Uh, I don't think it's that. Oh, it's that one. Okay, we're going to set our sieve right out here. Micro blocks sure do look nice, but they are a nuisance. <laughs> okay, so there's our sieve. And the last thing I think we needed to make is a bed. One, two, three. Beautiful. Left us with 16 because our fishing pole is almost toast. And a bed. Let's get rid of it. I wish you could break down these. Thing, like get redstone back a disassembling table all right let's check our quests boom, 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 boom. bam oh we didn't make the hammer dang it that's okay we can still make it perfect okay now let's complete our quest 100, 100, 100. Uh, we're going to choose seeds for the very purpose I just told you so that we can actually get some toast going um, carrots half a heart cotton no heart sugar canes good too but you can get the only one I don't think you can necessarily get from the seed is cotton seeds I don't remember I've ever got those maybe it's a rare one so, oh, we still have to do our first stone. Oh, poop, I forgot about that. Alright, so that means we need one more stinking barrel. Uh, give me one of these. And bubblegum. Nice full door. And what was I doing with that? There we go. Oh, nice. I mean, bad and nice at the same time. Nice because we will get lots and lots of uh, saplings from it, which we really need. Not nice because it's a pain in the bum to cut down. Alright, so if we put eight of our saplings in there, we'll let it sit for a minute, it'll turn to dirt. Oh, wow. I probably won't make you guys watch me cut that down. Because <laughs> I'm nice. But that will give us a lot of wood. That's good because it's going to give us lots of wood. We probably will lose some of the stuff. But, yeah, it's okay. Oh, uh, let's go put this in. And let's go see if our dirt's done. Not yet. Still working. And it's raining again. Okay, so we're going to put our dirt right here, and I don't want to do that yet. We might be able to get two dirt, hopefully. 
There's one. Uh, now, normally I wouldn't make it so I only had one sapling left, but uh, if I don't get a sapling from that, I that's just crazy. <laughs> All right, three. Crap. We only got three. Dang it. Which means we aren't going to be able to plant our seeds. Oop. Uh, why wait? Uh, let's throw that on the bed and take a nap. Maybe not. So we're good to go now because we have our fishing, we're able to catch fish. Um, that's going to be great for us. There we go. Now we got our one dirt, or our one cobble. We can complete this quest. Bam! And we can get our, we our seeds. Our weeds. <laughs> And we get an axe. Get the axe in there. Let's put our mallet in there. Rocks in there. That's actually that might we might be able to complete that quest. Uh, let's check. Okay, so we did that one. So now fish. Ah, check it out. Submit. All right. Let's see. Um. Ah. This is hard because let's just go for let's try three. Oh look, we just got one fish. I'll put you in there. Keep you, what quality? Basic. <laughs> A fishing rod. Well, that's good. We've almost broke our fishing rod. Factory reloaded. It's a weird looking fishing rod. It's got a fire reel on it or something. Okay, so are there any other? Let's sleep real quick. Nope, it's not night yet. Looks like it should be night. <laughs> oh. And there's that guy. Alright, let's see if there's anything else we can do. Quest-wise, I think we can actually do this one. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, we can make a sifter. We need one, two, three, four, five. I think we should be able to. All right, go hoop and a hoop and a hoop. Is that wrong? Oh, it sticks. Sticks. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now we're going. Uh, and that even gives us enough to... Voila! Complete! Uh, let's see. One and three. It was kind of poopy. Let's try number one. And we get 16 maggots. Okay, a skin. Oh, hi. Ooh, got a good bag. Not that that means much, but it says good. <laughs> and it's definitely night. Sleep. All right, so let's see. Let's open our bag. Be something good. Oh, fish. <laughs> uh, I don't know that I'd necessarily call that good. Fish, 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 fish. Worm. Fish. And we got our one cobble. Alright. Let's see what else we can do. Uh can't do that until we take down that tree. Oh, wrong button. 
Uh, can't do that till we get that at least. Can't do that till we have that. Wow, I think we're uh, pretty far, and now it's just grindy grind time. Oh, so um, I think I'll call it an episode. We're only probably about twenty some odd minutes in. Um, what I will do for the next episode, I might have a little wheat garden going up here, hopefully. Uh, I'll have that tree taken down, hopefully grown quite a few more. Uh, I'm going to try and get a surplus of, of stuff. So I'm going to, you know, take leaves, turn them into dirt, take dirt, turn it into cobble, take cobble and turn it into its things. Uh, and hopefully... One goal of mine will be is when I take cobble, let me just show you real quick. In case you don't know this, if you take, uh, whoops, I needed to grab the hammer. If you take cobble, put it down and hit it with this hammer, it turns to gravel. Now if you take gravel and put it down, hit it with a hammer, it turns to sand. If you hit sand, turn it, it uh, hit it with a hammer, it turns to um dust. <laughs> now if you take gravel, there's a very small chance we're going to get something good here. There we go. Well that's good enough. You get this. And you get all the different types of ores. So we got broken tin ore. Now if you take four of these, put these in your crafting area, you get a, a gravel well, in this case, it'd be a, a tin gravel block or whatever. And you break that, and then you get tin chunks or something like that. We'll, we'll definitely cover it as we go. But one thing we might get from doing gravel like that is iron. And if I can get iron, uh, at least two smelted, I can use these leaves in this. And we will be able to get dirt much, much faster and a lot less chance of losing our only trees since we only have the one right now. So that's my plan. I'm not going to complete any more quests. I'm just going to try and grind up a lot of dirt, a lot of cobble, maybe a bunch of gravel, and maybe some of the other things. Um, and uh, we'll continue from there. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I hope you're liking Agrarian Skies. If you want to know how to get it, or don't know how to get the different mod packs and stuff like that, um, let me know. In a, blah, 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 blah. Let me know down in the comments below. Let me know that uh, you'd like me to make some tutorial videos, and I'll make one for each of the launchers that I know of. I only know of three. There's the FTB launcher, the Feed the Beast launcher. There's the Technic launcher, and then there's the AT launcher. And each of them have their own mod packs, which have their own little uh perks and stuff like that really awesome things uh but if you're interested in that i'd be more than happy to throw together some tutorials on how to get them how to set them up how to customize them so they're going to better places on your hard drive and not cluttering up your minecraft folder so uh anyway guys like i said thank you so much for watching Really hope you enjoyed. I know I had a lot of fun. I really love this mod pack a lot. And uh, if you did enjoy, please leave a like. It helps me so much on YouTube. And until next time, guys. Oh, and of course, follow me on Twitter. Twitter.com forward slash T4ZZM4NN. And click the follow button. And comment, like, and subscribe. I'm trying to get lots and lots of subs so that I can get bonuses for you guys and everything. If I, like I said in, in my last Taz play, I said uh, if I can get big enough that maybe some game places will want to have me do their things and they send me the game, they might also send me versions or copies that I can give out to my fans or my subs. And I would love to do that for you guys. So. Tell all your friends, neighbors, enemies, acquaintances about my channel. Let them check it out. If they like it, they can sub. And uh, that's it, guys. Sorry, rambling on again. 
So uh, until next time, guys, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.